You know, all humans are limited by three things, the knowledge in our minds, the worth of our character, and the principles upon which we build our lives. Therefore, we need to develop ourselves, increase our skill sets, so we can empower others. Remember this, that there's no growth in the comfort zone. Keys for transformation is what we'll talk about. You can't expect others to believe in you if you don't believe in yourself. So that is so key. Leadership starts with us. We must have a growth mindset, be willing to grow. As leaders, we must develop increased thinking and have a growth mindset instead of a fixed mindset. Think of strategies to overcome deficits and improve where you are. Drive is a desire to achieve and improve. Take initiative, showing a willingness to act on opportunities. Then there are choices, selecting between two or more alternatives. Choices are our freedom. We get to choose. You can choose uh, every day and your choices always have consequences, good or bad. Your choices every day, you choose your character, you choose your priorities, relationships, and so much more. And so the ability to listen to others becomes criti critically important. And of course, the importance of training and development for the next generation. The next generation of millennials and Gen, Gen Xers and Zs are right upon us. They are stepping into key leadership roles in organizations. They need our help. Sometimes they may think, well, you know, you're, you're older. You're, you're part of the, the, the older generation. We don't do things like that now. But what I'm finding is that when you step back and really study what they're doing, they need our help. So the, the, I, I guess what I'm trying to say is with all the things going on around us, we can influence change. We can encourage personal development and we can we can be influencers in ways that only the kingdom of God will get the glory and the honor. But the expectation is that we will love, we will love the unlovable and we will serve the needs of others in our community. 